The sun is shining down at Media City and this is an incredible event from today through to Friday. This is the Grimshaw's Motor Show and we're inviting all of you today through to Friday to come down and get close up and personal with these beautiful vehicles. The sun is out. I'm down at Media City, home of the BBC, ITV and many other media companies and I'm with my friends the Grimshaws. The Grimshaws are a Vauxhall dealership just up the road and they brought down some good looking cars today. This one in particular has caught my eye. The paint is hardly dry on this baby here. It's called the Cascado, it's their flagship car and it's only been out for the last two months. Take a look inside, it, smell it touch it, breathe it, and sink into it, it's absolutely gorgeous. Now the top speed of the Cascada is 143 miles an hour, but why speed in a car like this? You want everyone to check you out. Get yourself on that leaderboard. The winner gets onto the leaderboard behind us, the Top Gear Grimshaw's Grand Prix leaderboard. And if you win, by the end of the week, it's a bottle of champagne to take home and enjoy. You can't say further than that. Here at Media City, we're trying to bring a motor show to town. Vauxhall have launched a lot of new models recently, the Adam, the Mocha, the Cascada, and these cars are absolutely fantastic. And we just wanted to bring them out to the public because we don't believe that you know people get the chance to see these cars every day. So here at Media City, hopefully they will. We supply over 4,000 cars and vans a year to up and down the whole of Great Britain. We've even delivered cars in the Shetland Isles. So tell me about your great-grandfather. Well, originally, um, he, he kind of went into the motor trade as the motor trade was evolving as, as, a, as a thing. He, he dealt with Mr Chrysler himself in America, and I've got a Telex at home, which is the famous Telex, where he imported a, one gross of Chrysler motor cars. For, just, it's amazing history, really. Well, you might recognise this little car. It's been whizzing around town for the last few months. Let me introduce you to Adam. This is high-end fashion, high-tech and highly desirable. This car is what we call a bespoke design, personalised to your requirements. Take a look inside. It may look small on the outside, but it's light and spacious in the inside. It has all the mod cons, including Bluetooth and also a nice sat-nav there. This car is economical. It's green and the tax per year is only £30. It's a no-brainer, really. I'm sitting in £350,000 worth of car. It's a classic car, it's a Vauxhall 1398 and it's the forefather of some of these beautiful new cars over there. On a day like this at the Grimshaws Motor Show where the sun is shining down, it's absolutely gorgeous. This 38 is celebrating 100 years this year. Yes, it's, the Mark was actually uh, launched at uh, May 1913 at Waddington Fell on the Trough of Bowland, which we celebrated last month. And we've now got a series of events through the rest of the year to celebrate this model. So I have to say, I'd be a bit confused about the pedals. Do you know why? Because the accelerator is in the middle. So for some of us who are not used to driving a 100-year-old car, you could get into some serious bother if I was just about to put the brake on. And instead, I went into Key House at Media City. Not, not so good. It really does attract attention, this type of car, because it is a classic and it goes alongside what Grimshaws stand for as well. There's been a Grimshaws in this part of the world for 130 years. So hand in hand, this motor show is more than just a swathe of good looking cars. It's all about history as well. 